Hello everybody, welcome back to another video. I got another tip for you today. Uh, by the title of this video, I'm gonna show you how to remove sweater nipples or sweater <laughs> hanger marks. I hate these because whenever I go to wear a sweater or a, a pullover sweater like this, a normal sweater or a cardigan, and I have these marks, it doesn't look great. So I wanna try and, I have a solution finally on the, how to eliminate these so they no longer appear on your sweaters and you can rock them all day long. Let's get right into this. Okay, so first of all, how do you get a sweater nipple? Uh, there's many different ways you could get this and the first reason why people get this is because they hang their sweaters on hangers. This over time, the sweater fabrics inside start to form to that hanger, which causes this little protrusion, the sweater nipple to appear when you go to put it on. The second reason why is if you do a wash and it says for your sweater to hang to dry, it's gonna be wet. And like I mentioned before, those fabrics are gonna to form to that hanger and cause this uh, sweater hanger mark to appear. I've tried many different um, ways to get rid of this. I've used, I've just put it in a dryer. I've tried uh, ironing it, but I finally found a way to eliminate uh, these marks don't don't do don't iron it don't put it in the dryer that'll waste your time because those don't work let me show you how to do it right now okay so like I previous previously mentioned if you do a wash and you hang it to dry those fibers inside form to whatever may interfere with it so to to fix this we're going to use water now I recommend doing this in the in your bathroom or wherever uh, I'm just doing it uh, in my living room and I got a towel on the floor so but anyways you want to first just stretch out the sleeves make sure nothing is in the way I this is what I did this morning with another sweater of mine I just happened to like stretch out that mark so it's you can't really see it see it just pops out there I sort of stretch it out and then all you want to do is you just want to soak this with a whole bunch of water get that spot nice and damp I should do this in the bathroom but get it all damp something like that once that spots damp all you want to do now is start to start to uh, pretty much rub that spot where it is it's gonna be hard to show you but what this is doing with this rubbing is you pretty much uh, forcing the fiber to form to form to your shoulder if the sweater can stay on my shoulder and this will in time eliminate that sweater mark because once once you uh, rub it a few times you'll start to see it disappear and then all you can do is let it dry and it should form to your shoulder or wherever this may be and it'll it'll just be gone like I said I did this this morning with another one of my sweaters um, it's a little hard showing you on camera how to do it but if you'll get the gist of it if, you, if you're doing this in the mirror or whatever, I'm doing it on camera. I'm gonna go finish this and I'll show you once it's dried what the result is. All right, I think that's good enough. I put more water on it, started rubbing it. And if, you, if you've already noticed, that mark is no longer there. This is gonna dry to my shoulder it's going to form my shoulder and it's not going to appear anymore. If you don't see it, go back to the start of the video, look at it then and look at it now. I can see it. It's gone. Like I said, I did this this morning with another sweater and that's been gone for a while now. Like I did it in the morning and I just put this on as a demo. It's still, there's no mark on there. So you just have to trust me like with this. If for some reason it doesn't work, let it dry, hit it with the water again and uh, you know just rub the fabric and it should form to your shoulder when it dries and just for future 
if you have a long sleeve sweater, cardigan, whatever, and you don't want this to happen in the first place, hang it like this. If you're going to hang it on a, uh, on a hanger, hang it like this. If it says hang to dry, obviously it'll take a little more uh, time to dry, but you're not going to have that, that hanger mark. So use this video, it'll help you. Uh, but yeah, thanks for watching. Don't forget to share, subscribe, and we'll see you next time. Have a good one.